Are you Austin Clients? What are you talking about? Except I was in Ames this you time. Why are and you I was like, what the fuck? God, he's listening. Damn it. <laughs> It's been a long 11 days. It's been a long 11 days. I mean, I got to come home a couple times, but I really wasn't here. Oh, sorry, the light. Finally just got back from Ames. It was an awesome, awesome weekend with everybody. A lot of great friends came out last night. Shout out to all of them. We got this cool picture together. I'm just beat. I'm exhausted. By the end of last night, it was pretty busy. <laughs> And I was just, I was just exhausted. My throat was sore, I was scared I was gonna get sick again, so I just started pounding water. Um, and we got hit with a huge snowstorm, jeez. I don't know if you can see. At least a good six inches down in Ames. Don't quote me on that though. But I'm just exhausted. I'm gonna take the rest of the day to, to just relax. I'm gonna veg out and watch all the movies, catch up on everything I've been missing out on, and I'm gonna do nothing. Okay, so I just paused this. I didn't want to steal their video and put it online. Um, I was watching this on Facebook. I follow these just weird things to... I just find it interesting. I don't know. Um, just what happens when vinegar and an egg and it becoming translucent or something. And I don't know. I haven't really followed the whole thing, but... Yeah, vinegar's crazy, first of all. Um, I'm... It shows this little equation. I'll put it up. And I'm... I'm not good with chemistry, um, and I don't like it, and I guess I never really liked it because I didn't give it a chance. In high school, I really didn't, I really didn't care about classes, I didn't care about learning, I didn't care about information. Um, it's just hanging out in friends and just, a lot of music though. Uh, choir, show choir, all that jazz. But, yeah, I mean physics kind of came, I understood physics so it was easy, but chemistry just didn't click. And I guess I didn't like it because I was bad at it, and I was bad at it because I didn't like it. It's just this infinite loop. And now I'm like intrigued. I see this equation, and I want to see how it's. I want to see. I don't even know how it works. That's terrible, right? You should stay in school. Pay attention in school. Excuse me. So I'm gonna figure this. I'm gonna figure this thing out. Okay, so I just moved out of Chicago, and I know somewhere in here is my... I have this, like, black binder that I used to use. There's, why are there rockets in there? That's not good. Uh, that's my green one. I can't even tell what's in that. I need to move all this stuff. Definitely need to take one of these, actually, though, because I don't want to get sick. I don't have the cool Casey knife. Mine's not at all cool. Sorry. Why didn't I cut this side when I did that? That's worse, isn't it? Or I could put this down and use two hands. Ah! I have a good memory of where things are at, I feel like. So, a weird thing. Um, I didn't like using lined paper for a while. Or actually, I mean, I had to do a lot of drawings for a lot of my engineering or computer science classes or make weird things. So. I could have gotten grid paper, but I was just cheap, and I just took 
a bunch of printer paper, put holes in it, and that's what I used for everything. Like, the first page always had my assignments for each class, and I made weird little codes, like, of my classes. Maybe discrete, discrete structure. Oh, here it is. Data structures, discrete, computer organization, programmable logic controller, PLC was fun class, and human geography, because I needed to finish those out. This is weird. I also have the worst handwriting. It's just because I, I don't know. This is what I want. Something with lines. Alright, it's almost five o'clock. Uh, I'm gonna make some food. There's so much stuff everywhere. I have a bunch of my stuff back. Even though I have to pack it up all again. Got a bunch of my stuff back and gonna use it. Actually, I've got a story about this. My grandpa had this light up here and I had this cable that went all the way down and plugged in there and it made this giant triangle. It was terrible. So, during the winter when I got bored one time, I actually removed this. I drilled a hole, put the cable through there after I cut the block off. And I didn't do it that well. I need to redo this, but I I carved the amount of space needed to lay the cable down, down along the side, and I actually went down in here, I went down and under, and if you look, I was gonna drill it through, but this stuff is, I don't know what this is, it's just thick. I don't know construction that well as far as walls, so I don't know, this was hard to get through. So I didn't do it. So I just ran into this thing. So this is like an old radio slash intercom system that I... It was like 6 a.m. I was tired. I cleaned everything up. And I'll finish this some other time. Because I thought it would be really cool, even though I don't need the intercom, but to attach an auxiliary cable to it. And then I'd just have music playing everywhere without having to wire speakers throughout the entire house. Like, this is already done. So that's a project for another time. See, this is why I can never buy groceries, is because I'm gone all the time and everything just goes bad. The spinach didn't, the kale is done for. <laughs> 